Hello everybody, and welcome back to brand new Daddy Overflow video. I'm sorry, welcome back to brand new Daddy Overflow video. Today we're going to be talking about a tool or an AI model which actually helps you and finds vulnerabilities for you, and it can definitely be used within research. Now before we get started, please make sure to subscribe. We're trying to hit 100,000, so please follow support me we're actually very close to 50k so please make sure to subscribe other than that check out my two or three courses android app hacking course bug bounty course and game hacking course links are in the description now let's go with the video so the tool that we're going to be using today is called Penlegend, and it's very easy. You basically, after you install it on your Kali Linux machine, as you can see, I'm Kali, on Kali Linux, and this is the first time I actually I was on Kali uh, in the history of the channel. So basically, go over to Tasks and create a new task, and basically enter the name, blah, 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 blah and create it. And once you're actually here, once you have followed the quick tutorial to install, trust me, it's very easy to install it on Kali. On Windows and on these operating systems, it's coming very soon. So first things first, after you're here, you can copy this and tell the actual AI what do you want to research. So basically, uh, say, research this for XSS. And then you give the AI like the link and you click enter, and it's going to start researching this exact link for XSS, because we already know that there is XSS here. Imagine if this was actually a real website, which are gonna be using on bug bounty programs. So as of now, as you can see, it told me that XSS vulnerability research, the target research, and the AI will conduct a comprehensive XSS or cross-site scripting research on the target. And currently what it does, it just gives us a execute like selected tools. And it's very easy. It gives you all of these to execute, and then it will tell you analyzing, analyze that based on the results. It will tell you what to do next. Or if you found something, it will tell you, hey, we found something. So let's click Execute Selected Tools. And over here on the right, you will see that we already actually did solve the challenge. That was crazy. But um, uh, it's currently analyzing the tool, analyzing the results. But we can see that it actually executed that. And yeah, we found the vulnerability. And actually, you can see it was found already. It was simple as that. So actually, if you didn't see, I didn't even tell the AI that I'm going and that I want to look for XSS in search. I just copied this link, pasted it to the AI, and the AI did the job. And as you can see, it over here tells us security analysis confirm reflected XSS has been found, which is very interesting. And this is the actual script. So it can't actually then do more, but it doesn't have to. To maybe do other more do other tests to see whether this actually is uh, Maybe there's some more vulnerabilities tied to it because if you found one, chances are there's probably more. Okay, so let's actually see what's the payload. This is the payload, and let's actually see whether it works. It told me that the search was the parameter. So what's the parameter? Okay, so it's search. So we have to put it here. Let's click enter. Ah, uh, would you look at that alert? What? This is very simple challenge, but still AI was actually able to do this whole thing for us. Let's solve another one while we at it. Let's solve another challenge, but this time let's go for SQL injection. Let's see whether this can do the SQL injection. So let's create a new task for this. Let's call it SQL injection. So let's create the task and let's actually now do this. So this is a simple, very simple like lab again, but let's see how actually can you do it. So what are what is the actual thing? We have to uh, application display one or more unreleased projects. So we essentially need to tell the AI, hey, I want to see unreleased products on this page with SQL. Can you help me with that? So, so I asked him, can we use SQLI to find unreleased products on this page? Let's click enter. And now this AI will go ahead and analyze this whole website, try to find actual like weaknesses and spots where it can actually inject the payload. And let's see what it comes up with. Okay, so it already told us what we we're going to do. So maybe, maybe there's, maybe there's some, some of them which will trigger, maybe not, but let's just wait until and see whether any of these would actually execute and display anything. So let's click this SQL injection will be found, of course, but we actually want the unreleased products because that is actually the solution. Even though it's a very weird solution, if you got SQLI, you should definitely report it. Forget about the unreleased products, because if you get the unreleased products and display them, then that's kind of illegal. But if he actually manages to figure out, okay, there's SQLI, we can trigger an error. That's pretty epic. Uh, let's see what he actually does. Also, you got a terminal over here, pretty epic. And you can see all of the execution results and everything else which is happening, which is pretty damn cool. 
So let's wait until this is done and let's see the actual results. So currently, it told me that there is a SQLi, but it also wants to test some of the, some of the interesting stuff like testing or one equals one. This could display all of the products, including the unreleased ones. So maybe maybe that is actually how it goes. So let's click execute this and execution failed, but we solved the lab apparently. Uh, syntax error apparently some some messed up i probably it is probably my it's probably on my end um but as you can see with regardless of that we actually was able to figure it out and find one which would actually give us all of the products including the unreleased ones which was definitely one thing so let's take a look and let's wait a little bit and see what's going on i think i probably misconfigured a bash because i'm an idiot sometimes but there it is so this is a analysis has been confirmed we did find it and this is actually what was the payload apparently this is the inserted query and we found these products it also tells you these products which is kind of cool and yeah that was actually what we had to do so you can get this software it is in the description box below as well as a the pinned comment so if you want to check it out for yourself it's only currently available for linux i think mac os as well uh, let's actually check which platforms is this available on. So currently it is available for Kali and Mac and for Windows it's coming very soon, but this is for Mac ARM64. So thank you so much for watching this video. Make sure to check the description for the software. Stay safe, stay responsible, use this only on bug bounty programs and programs you have actual proper authorization. And as always, peace.